Hey guys, okay, so I wanted to real quickly give you guys a review of magnetic lashes. I don't know about you, but I have tried these. I ordered them, I think the first time that I ever saw them was on a Facebook ad, um, probably a year ago, I guess, maybe, maybe not that long ago, but I ordered them. They were junk. I did not like the way they felt. They didn't snap together. Not a good look at all. But none of them went across the entire eye. So I was kind of disappointed in that. I didn't want just the little flares on the end. I wanted it to look like false lashes without the glue. So these are by Ardell and I think they're pretty new. They have three different um, designs and according to their website, it was their most popular, um, what do you call that? designs, models, flavors, I don't know, the most popular ones. And the one that I have here, these are the double wispies. And I think I also have from, um, from Ulta, I have another pair on the way that are just the Demi wispies. But I really like lush, big, fluffy lashes. So I think I'm gonna like these. All right, so according to their website, um, the lady, and I have mascara on my hands already. Okay, so the lady online on their training video, she just, I'm going to have to look down here to do this. She just placed it on top of her lashes. So super easy. And then you get the one going underneath. And, alright, so this is going to not work. I can tell you that. <laughs> okay. Hey, that's not too bad. <laughs> um, I don't think they're on there at all. That feels really funky on my eye. <laughs> Can y'all even see? Uh, hmm. It feels funky on my eye. Is it's nowhere near my skin. <laughs> uh, it's kind of like out on my little hairs. It says to release them. You're kind of oh lord. Please don't rip my eyelashes off. The lady online just ah oh, okay that wasn't too bad. Okay so the lady online. You twist your, you kind of rub your fingers, rub them like this, and they come off. So that's good to know. I know y'all hear my dog snoring. He's snoring. And I'm going to place it, kind of wiggle it like you would normal lashes in place. Okay, and then come underneath. And get nowhere near where you're supposed to be. Um, supposed to just easily come up underneath. And they're supposed to just snap together. So perfect. I mean, that's about as close as I can get them. Can y'all see that? That is about as close as I can get them without doing a hack. Um, and I'll show you the problem with that. <laughs> <laughs> is here. You see how that's like got a gap? A pretty decent gap between my lash and um <laughs> and where I want it to be. So let me now chop them up because that's what the hack is. So I'm going to remove them, which I'm getting good at doing that because I've taken these off 400 times. So this is the top one. We're going to leave that one alone. I'm going to put it down and the bottom layer, the one that sandwiches up underneath, the one that's giving me fits trying to attach. We're gonna cut this. I hate to do it, but we're going to. We've got to, because they're kind of useless as they are. So our bottom little strip here, I think it has four magnets, not the top one. We want the underneath piece. We're gonna cut it into three pieces, and I want a magnet on each piece. Ha! Ah! There goes the first little piece. This is the, you have the top strip that sits above your lashes and then you have the strip that goes underneath. Well, what I've done is the strip that goes underneath, I've cut it into thirds. And that's gonna be really hard to see. We're gonna pull, here's a little piece that goes on the end. It has its own little magnet. I've made sure to cut it so that the magnet, come on. So that the magnet is still with that piece. So there's the end piece. Then we have, and this is on the bottom layer, I think I said that. 
Then I have the inner corner. It has its own little magnet, so make sure you cut it. You could cut it um, <laughs> and forget that little magnet, but then you wouldn't have a magnet on the end piece, so don't do that. You wanna cut it into thirds, and then that leaves me the middle chunk. And the middle chunk, if you cut it right, will have two magnets, one on either end. All right, so my mirror is right here underneath my lens. Um, I'm going to try to keep it where y'all can see. I've already filmed this once and I was too preoccupied with putting them on myself and I could not, <laughs> I didn't film anything. Y'all just got the top of my head. All right, so we have the lash and I'm going to start by resting it on top of my lashes. Now, an important hack for this, or not hack, but a step that you have to do, is you have to have mascara on your natural lashes, and I've already curled my lashes, um, just to kind of give them a lift a little bit, so I've curled them that way, and they have one coat of mascara to give some kind of bones or some kind of structure for these to sit on, because I think they would just fall off. So that's important, and that's already been done, and I'm gonna put them as close to my skin as I can get it, and I want to try to position it now. Now is the time to position it. Not after you've snapped the under piece in. I've got a pair of tweezers and I'm going to start by snapping into place the bottom third over here on the outside corner. And so that's going to look like this little piece. So we have our piece underneath. Come from underneath. I'm gonna kind of hold it in position with my finger and come from under here and just lay it on and then just kind of tap it okay and so there is our first piece the inner corner of the eye same kind of thing I'm gonna hold it up like with my hold it from above kind of in position as close to my skin as I can get it because I don't want them sticking out so kind of hold it in close and then come from underneath and lay it on. Perfect, look at that. Okay, and then the middle chunk, which is the easiest part. You get that middle chunk right there. Okay, we're gonna come from underneath, right in the middle, and lay it on. Oh my gosh, how easy was that? I mean, y'all saw me fighting with it <laughs> when it was one solid piece. I was fighting with it the whole entire time. We'll try it with the other side just so y'all can see both. All right, so to remove them, it says to kind of roll your fingers. And I pulled off the outside piece. Roll your fingers. Don't tug. Yeah. And it just comes off. I mean, it does not pull on your lashes or anything crazy like that. The very first thing is we take our solid piece that we've not cut, which goes above the lashes. As soon as we focus back again. All right, we're gonna just rest that above my lashes, I think. Okay, so get it where you would like it. Pick up your tweezers again. We're gonna do the outside and then go to the inner quarter. So the outside one first, got it here. <laughs> Looks like a little spider. Spider on a tweezer. Still, uh oh. Make sure you kind of grab it towards the middle or the end because if you get it too close to the magnet, it will stick to your tweezers. All right, so then you just come from underneath and layer it on there. And it grabbed it. I mean, I felt it. It just snapped into position. Okay, inner corner. Here we go. Focus, focus. All right, inner corner is a little bit more difficult for me, so I'm gonna hold it with this finger and let it just grab on. <laughs> I'm so excited, this is so much better than trying to put the whole entire strip on your eye. No, that just doesn't work. Okay, so middle piece, magnets facing the right way, tweezer facing the right way, got a hold of it, and then just come from underneath and lay it on there. Now that is as simple as it gets. I'm real happy with that, y'all. 
that you have to do it. You have to cut them. Cut them, cut them, cut them now. Cut them. Cut them into thirds. You have your whole strip. There's a magnet on this end, a magnet on that end, and two in the middle. So just cut it right here next to the middle ones, which will give you a longer chunk for your middle section and then your two little end pieces. Uh, it works best for me to put the outside one on first, then go to the inside and then finish with that one in the middle. And I cannot feel these. These feel great. And um, this is probably my maybe third or fourth time to put them on. So um, it gets easier. This, you have to do this. You have to cut them. Cut them, cut them, cut them. Okay, so that's it for today. I am ready to party with my magnet lashes. Um, hope y'all have a good one. Subscribe to my channel and I will see you next time. Bye guys.